If you've ever thought about raising ducks, whether for meat, eggs, or even as ornamental animals, this video is for you. Today, we're going to dive into the world of duck raising, bringing you 100% scientifically based information. Did you know that ducks have one of the best feed conversion rates among poultry? And that their meat is highly nutritious? Let's understand how these incredible animals are raised. Why raising ducks? Meat and egg production. Ducks are highly productive. Their meat is rich in proteins and essential fatty acids. Duck eggs have a higher fat and protein content than chicken eggs. Source, FAO, Food and Agriculture Organization of the United Nations. Ease of management, resistant to diseases and adaptable to different climates. Use of resources, they consume agricultural leftovers and help control pests. Low maintenance costs, unlike chickens, Ducks do not need perches and do not scratch, reducing soil damage. Choosing the right breed. Ducks for meat production. Peking duck, Anas platyrinkos domesticus, fast growth, tasty meat, and high feed conversion. Studies from Wageningen University indicate that it can reach 3 kilograms in 7 weeks. Mueller duck, cross between the Peking duck and the Barbella duck. Widely used in the production of foie gras. Ducks for egg production. Indian runner duck, excellent posture, 200 to 300 eggs slash year, less water requirement. Khaki Campbell duck, champion in posture, can lay up to 340 eggs per year. Source, poultry production manual, FAO. Ornamental or pest control ducks. Carolina duck, mandarin duck, widely used as decorative birds. Muscovy duck, Kyrena muscata, known for its resistance to diseases and for consuming insects and weeds. Environment and infrastructure. Area and space. Space per duck. Recommended 3 to 5 square meters per bird to avoid overcrowding. Source. Poultry Science Journal. Ponds and wetlands. Ducks do not need large ponds, but a small tank or access to water improves their well-being. Shelters must be protected from predators and strong winds. Floor, can be made of beaten earth, lined with straw or shavings to absorb moisture. Sanitary management and hygiene. Importance of cleaning, prevents diseases such as colobacillosis and salmonellosis. Vaccination and deworming, ducks are resilient but can be affected by avian diseases. Source, American Poultry Association. Proper feeding, feeding stages. Chicks, 0 to 3 weeks, starter feed with 20 to 22% protein. Studies from the University of Minnesota indicate that nutrition in the early phase impacts future development. Growth, 3 to 7 weeks, growth feed with 16 to 18% protein. Adults, balanced diet with grains, corn, wheat, rice, vegetable proteins, and insects. Allowed and forbidden foods. Allowed. Vegetables, cooked rice, insects. Forbidden, bread, onion, garlic, chocolate, and processed foods. Reproduction and egg hatching. Natural incubation. Females of some breeds are good mothers, such as the Muscovy duck. Artificial incubation. Ideal temperature of 37.5 degrees Celsius and humidity of 55 to 65%. Incubation period. 28 days in most breeds. Common diseases and prevention. Main diseases. Pastoralosis, bacteria that causes septicemia. Vaccination recommended. Botulism, food poisoning by toxins in decomposing organic matter. Nutritional deficiencies, low vitamin A can cause blindness in ducks. Preventive measures, providing clean water and a balanced diet. Controlling pests and rodents. Separating sick birds. Fun facts, are ducks monogamous? Not always. Some species form fixed couples, while others change partners with each reproductive cycle. The digestive system of ducks is adapted to process vegetation and proteins of animal origin. In Japan and China, duck meat is considered a delicacy and is part of traditional dishes, such as Peking duck. Now that you know everything about raising ducks, tell me, are you interested in starting? Which breed caught your attention the most? Leave your comment below. If this video helped you, like it, share it, and subscribe to the channel for more content on raising and animal management.